What's going on guys? It's Gino from Modern Accessory Review and today we are talking about the JBL Charge 4. This speaker was released in August 30th, 2018 and quickly gained a ton of popularity. I personally bought it for $120 because I believe the best review should be from someone who has ex personal experience with the product. If you are interested in checking today's updated pricing, I put a link in the description below this video that leads to what Amazon is offering today. I am here to help you find the best product for yourself. So is the JBL Charge 4 right for you? Let's find out in the review. Starting off with build quality and design, the JBL Charge 4 has definitely impressed me. It is clean and modern with it being 8.66 inches in length and 3.48 inches in width. Wrapping around the speaker, we have the same durable fabric that many other portable speakers have been using. On the side of the speaker, we have rubberized plastic that absorbs impact so you won't have to worry too much if you accidentally drop this baby. On the bottom of the speaker, we have the same rubbery plastic material, so the speaker stays in place when you set it down. Of course, we have those incredible bass radiators on each side of the speaker that vibrate when music is playing. The only negative about the build of the Charge 4 is that it's heavier than the previous Charge 3, which makes it a little less portable. It weighs 2.12 pounds and will definitely make your bag a lot heavier when carrying it. Adding to the speaker's incredible durability, it is also IPX7 certified, which means it is waterproof. With my testing, the speaker actually floats, which makes it great for the pool, lake, or even the hot tub. There are also many different color options, but the color I have here is just the standard black, which I think looks the best. In terms of buttons, we have a total of six. They are all on the top of the speaker and are very accessible. Starting from the left, we have the JBL Connect button, which allows you to pair other JBL speakers together to play and sync, which is great to have. Then we have the volume down button, power button, Bluetooth, volume up button, and last but not least, the pause, play, or skip tracks button. Unfortunately, we don't have the option to skip back to the previous song but we can skip forward to the next song. JBL claims up to 20 hours of battery life. Now remember, expect less than this because you will probably be using the speaker around 50% volume or higher most of the time. And JBL tests their battery life at low volumes. The higher the volume, the more battery will be used. The battery life is about average with its competitors and should definitely be enough for the average consumer. I haven't had any problems with the speaker dying on me because of the incredible battery indicators. We have five LED lights that will tell you how charged your speaker is. I love this feature because many of JBL's competitors don't have a good battery indicator. On the back of the speaker, behind the waterproof flap, we have a USB type C for charging, which I am happy about, a three and a half millimeter input for physical connections, and a USB port if you wanted to charge your phone from the speaker. The JBL Charge 4 has Bluetooth 4.2, which is fine, but I would have preferred Bluetooth 5.0 because it's slightly better. In terms of range, I was able to get about 87 feet before the music started to cut out, which is really good. Pairing the speaker is just as easy as any other speaker, so you won't have any problems there. Now let's get to the audio test and I will see you guys after. Till I get up, time is barely on our side. I don't wanna waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us, and love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah, no, I don't wanna waste what's left. And on and on we'll go through the wastelands, through the highways, till my shadow. Turns the sun rays and on and on 
Now, let's talk about the most important part of the review, the sound quality. Let me start off by telling you I really enjoy the audio of the JBL Charge 4 more than almost all of the other portable speakers in this price range. But without being said, there are a few negatives. We don't have 360 degree audio like the Bose SoundLink Plus, so the audio only comes out of the front of the speaker. Most front-facing speakers have two audio drivers, while the JBL Charge 4 only has one large one. But no more complaining, because overall, I still think this speaker beats its competitors in this price range in terms of audio. The vocals are clear, precise, and produce more depth, creating a wide variety of audio. The bass is clean and punchy, the vocals are more pronounced, and the high notes are never too sharp up top. The JBL Charge 4 adds more character and depth to the audio than its competitors like the UE Mega Blast and the Sony SRS XB41. Wrapping up the review, is the JBL Charge 4 right for you? Well, if you are looking for a speaker that has a lot of character with its audio, has good portability, is completely waterproof, has decent battery life, is extremely durable, has good range, has battery indicators, and has those sweet bass radiators on the sides, then I highly recommend the speaker. Now, if you already have the JBL Charge 3, then the only main difference to the Charge 4 is a little more character with the audio and USB Type-C. If you guys enjoyed the review, make sure to smash that thumbs up button and subscribe for future videos. I really appreciate those of you who do that. If you have any questions or feedback, make sure to leave it in the comments below and I will get back to you. Also, feel free to follow me on Instagram at Modern Accessory Review, where we will be doing a free giveaway soon. Also, before I let you go, I wanted to show you guys this incredible wallet that I received from Exter.com. All of their wallets are made from premium leather and you have easy access to all of your cards simply by pressing down on this small lever. We have a strap inside the wallet to put your cash, and they also have a tracking card that you can get separately so you will never have to worry if you lose your wallet. I am a huge fan of what this company is doing, so definitely check them out. Their Instagram is at extra wallets. So without further ado, I'll see you guys in my next review. Peace.